I am the flag of the United States of America. My name is Old Glory. I fly atop the world's tallest buildings, and I stand watch in America's halls of justice. I fly majestically over great institutions of learning, and I stand guard to the greatest military power in the world. Look up and see me. I stand for peace, honor, truth, and justice. I stand for freedom. I am confident, I am arrogant, and I am proud. When I am flown with my fellow banners, my head is held a little higher. My collars are a little truer. I out to know one. I'm recognized all over the world. I'm worshipped. I'm saluted. I'm respected. I'm revered. I am loved. And I am feared. For more than 200 years, I have fought in every battle of every war. Gettysburg, Shiloh, Appomattox, the trenches of France, the Argonne Forest, Anzio, Rome, the beaches of Normandy, the jungles of the Philippines, Guam, Okinawa, Tarawa, Korea, Vietnam. In the heat of the Persian Gulf, in a score of other places, long forgotten by all but those who were there with me. I was there. I led my sailors and my marines. I followed them. I watched over them. They loved me. I was in a small hill in Iwo Jima. I was dirty. Battle torn and tired of my sailors and my marine to cheer me. I was proud. I was at Ground Zero on September 11 in New York City as cowardly fanatics attacked America. I was raised from the ashes of once proud buildings by brave firefighters, heroes who risked their lives to save others, showing all that America, although bloody, will not be. Those who destroy me cannot win, for I am a symbol of freedom, of one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I've been soiled, <coughs> burned, torn, and trampled on the streets of my own country. And when it is done by those whom I have served with in battle, it hurts. But I shall overcome, for I am strong. I have slipped to the surely bounds of earth, and from my vantage point in the moon, I stand watch over the uncharted new frontiers of space. I have been a silent witness to all of America's finest hours, but my finest hour comes when I am torn into strips to be used as bandages for my wounded comrades in the field of battle. When I, when I fly half mast to honor my soldiers, my airmen, my sailors, and my marines, and when I lie in the trembling arms of a grieving mother at the graveside of a I am proud. My name is all glory. Long may I wave, dear God, my God. Long may I wave. Let's detail and salute. Ready, two.